Good evening. I am Destiny Mama. This is News Now. The House of Representatives Committee on Appropriation has summoned the heads of the Central Bank, or Lady Cardozo FIRS boss, and the Controller General of Customs to appear in person before the House Committee unfailingly on Monday, 11th December 2023. The Chairman House of Representatives Committee on Appropriations, Honorable Abubakar Kabiru Bichi, had during the interactive session with relevant MDAs on Appropriations Bill 2024, refused to allow representatives of these three organizations represent their bosses at the ongoing budget interaction. Honorable Bichi went ahead to state the objective of the engagement, which, among others, is to provide highlights on some key issues in relation to the preparation, enactment, and implementation of the 2024 budget. Ministers, uh, MDAs, we are all supposed to think that way. We are supposed to think, like not, not just administer our ministries, but to think out of the box. What are those things we can migrate from the budget? There is a lot the private sector can do, so I should also see my role as a minister as that of inviting the private sector, marketing them so that they can do those things which appropriation cannot give me the money to do. We are not going to have enough money to build all the houses we require, and, and indeed the roads we require. So the ministers are urged to think, and it has been done before, and we are, we have been directed to uh, do that will complement whatever funding. But the importance of the budget is a signaling tool, it's a catalytic tool, and it's equitable so that all can feel uh, involved. Uh, the first point we really need to make is that, uh, as most of us will be aware, uh, we have run budget deficits for many years, for decades for which the Debt Management Office has been raising funds, local and international, to support the budget. Okay. And uh, the point I also like to make is, as the level of borrowing increases, because these are borrowings, they're debt, you have to service them, so debt service also increases, just to make that basic point. Again, just to say again for the purpose of all of us here, we run budget deficits, yes, that's because there are programs and projects in the budget that the government wants to run. Um, if we go back uh, from 2015, 2016, we know we've uh, been through about two or three recessions. We had one in, uh, in uh, 2016, 2017. We also had one during COVID. So a lot of that bringing the economy out of recession was funded from borrowing. The first one was through the Economic Recovery and Growth Plan. Then the last one we had was during COVID. So debt has increased. Meanwhile, the House of Representatives... Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.